Welcome to a Phoenix Technologies instructional video, Portable DC High Pot Test Sets. Our DC High Pots are designed and manufactured in our factory located in the state of Maryland. We also have company owned and operated sales and service facilities located in Basel, Switzerland and Taipei, Taiwan. This is in addition to having independent sales representatives throughout the world. DC testing is popular because the equipment is more compact and lighter in weight than comparable AC equipment. Phoenix manufactures five different portable DC high pods, ranging from 0 to 40 kV up to 0 to 160 kV. Our DC high pods are designed to test electrical switch gear, cables, motors, generators, protective equipment and more. These units are lightweight, sturdily built, portable, enclosed in a rugged, high-density polyethylene carrying case and are suitable for field or lab use. These units are shipped complete with two instruction manuals and include all input and output power leads required for testing. All units are available for an input power supply of either 120 volts AC 60 Hz or 220 volts AC 50 Hz. Your choice of either input power must be stated at time of purchase. In addition to these high pots, we have two optional purchase shorting sticks. Both are rated for up to 100 kV DC and are of two-piece design for easy transport and storage. The model GS100-2 ground stick is used for grounding relatively low capacitance test objects such as insulators, switch gear, and motors. The model DS100-2 discharge stick has a resistor in series with ground to bleed the charge from higher capacitance test objects in a controlled manner, such as shielded cables. The model 440-20, rated 0 to 40 kV at 20 milliamps. The model 475-20, rated 0 to 75 kV at 20 milliamps. The model 4100-10, rated 0 to 100 kV at 10 milliamps. The model 4120-10, rated 0 to 120 kV at 10 milliamps. The high voltage section is separate from the controls and metering module. The model 4160-5, rated 0 to 160 kV at 5 milliamps. This unit also has the high voltage section separate from the controls and metering module. Operation of these units is simple. We will go through an example of an actual test sequence using the model 440-20. All units have identical control and measurement features with the exception of meter ranges. The main difference between the units is output voltage, weight, and that the 120 kV and 160 kV units have separate high voltage tanks. To begin the test sequence, plug power input cable into test unit. The main power switch on the front panel must be in the off position before proceeding. Here are the return, ground and guard terminals. For test objects that have the low potential side at ground reference, connect the return terminal to ground terminal using the slip clip provided. Connect grounded side of test object to return terminal using the red lead. For test objects that have the low potential side isolated from ground, there is an alternative connection, as shown with model 475-20, with the slip clip between the ground terminal and guard terminal, that will allow the current meter to read only current passing through the test object. Do not operate unit with the slip clip removed or not connected to either return or guard terminal. Connect the high voltage output cable to the high potential side of the test specimen. Connect the input main power cable to an appropriate power source. Performing an actual high pot test. Check that the voltage control is set to zero. Select the proper voltmeter range, desired current meter range, and desired trip level for current range selected. Turn on the control main power switch. The power on lamp will illuminate. Momentarily press the HV on push button. High voltage will be applied to the test specimen and the HV on light will illuminate. Rotate the voltage control dial and watch the output voltmeter increase until desired voltage level is reached. The voltage control knob is calibrated in percent of voltage range selected. 
with the voltage control knob at the 10% position and the voltage range selector switch at 40 kV, the test set output is approximately 4 kV for the model 440-20. Current meter will read resulting current. Record data if desired. If an overcurrent situation occurs, that is where the output current exceeds the overcurrent trip set point, the overload will activate and the high voltage will switch off. To enable the high voltage on, the overload reset button must be depressed and the voltage control dial must be returned to zero. Then press the HV on button momentarily to turn high voltage back on. Lower the voltage control to zero after testing is completed. Depress high voltage off button. The high voltage indicator light will go out. Use the appropriate discharge or grounding stick to discharge the test object or allow the voltage to return to zero. The voltmeter will read any residual voltage that may be present on the test object's high voltage terminal with the high pot output voltage turned off. After testing is completed, turn off the front panel main power switch. Make sure the test specimen is totally discharged and grounded before removing the test cables. Now let's go over some additional design and safety features of these high pots. The analog charging current meter. This meter indicates percent of output charging current for a selected range. An overtrip current may be avoided by the operator monitoring the meter and by adjusting the voltage rate of rise to control the output current. The external safety interlock. The high pot is shipped with a jumper in the connector that allows the operator to use the high pot without an external safety interlock circuit. If an external interlock safety device is desired, such as a foot-operated switch, you would remove the jumper and replace it with the safety switch device. Our high pots have a built-in discharge circuit. This feature allows any residual charge that may remain on the test object to discharge after the high pot is turned off. The fuse is sized to protect the control power circuit. The thermal overload protects the high voltage transformer. Thank you for watching this video. Please go to our website for additional information regarding our portable DC high pots and the many other high voltage and high current test sets manufactured by Phoenix Technologies.